Hi, this is Rich Coles from Productive Project Solutions. The purpose of this video is to give a quick demo of how easy and effective it is to use the proofing capability in Smartsheets for images, PDF files and videos. What's so great about this function is it enables all comments to be captured at an item level within a sheet where other reviewers can also see them and where approvals can be recorded and where there's a version history. This can save so much time and heartache in reviewing designs and remove the back and forth between emails and version control. Now, this is core app functionality, so it's available to all Smartsheet licensed users, and the reviewers do not need a license to be able to make comments. And the proofs can even be shared with people outside the organization who do not have a Smartsheet account, although they'll only be able to comment and not approve or request changes. So let's have a look. So in this case, I've got a property list and for 100 mansions, I'm going to upload a proof of the floor plan. So here I'm going to press the button, add a proof. And in this case, I'm going to upload a file. I can drag it. So if I go and find the file, I'm dragged, I've dragged it up. It uploads the file, and as soon as that's done, it's going to ask me to invite people. So you can see the image now, and I'm going to invite Fiona Roncal and Alejandra Rojas to review. <clears throat> it, as you will see in the email, it also populates the content, so you don't have to change that. However, you can obviously change it if you so desire. So that one's already sent, that happened pretty quickly. You can see pending two, so that has already gone. What I'm also gonna show you is, if we just go back and come out of this for a moment. So for two Madrid mansions, I'm gonna actually upload a video and show you how easy this is for videos as well. So you can also click on proofs here on the right-hand side and create a proof. So for this one, for the line, I'm gonna upload a video and just find a video which I'm going to drag into here and videos will take a bit longer to upload given the size but that's uploaded and then it's preparing the video ready for this so again I'm going to invite and this time I'm just going to send that to Alejandra and send and here what I'm going to do is say please review draft video so I'm going to press send and that will go to Alejandra. It's still preparing the video. So whilst it's still preparing the video, I'm going to go and show one final piece, which is going to create a proof. And in this case, I'm going to update and upload a file, a PDF file. Which I've dragged in. And here's the document. Now, what I want to do is also just highlight some things. And so I'm going to say, please let me have feedback on title. So I'm going to post that comment. And in this case, I'm just going to send this to Fiona wrong cow and I'm going to send so all of these have been sent so now let's come out of this and well you can see the proofs they're showing in the system here and so let's go across to this is first Alejandra's file and you can see there's two requests which have come in so one I want you to review one Madrid mansions so in this place review the proof proofs in let's have a look at it Okay, and looking at it, I can see that actually, rather than two sofas, I, two armchairs, I want a sofa here. So I'm going to click on this. And I'm going to put a comment here saying, please replace with sofa. Add the comment. And here I'm going to say, remove chair add in media unit against wall so that's gone i'm going to say it requires changes from my side 
So we can close that one and then also to review the video. So if we're going to review the video in this case, so you can see it's a 20 second video down here. With videos, what you can do is you can then get it to play the video. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to drag it through part way through. And here again, what you can do is you can annotate. And I'm going to say, please check formatting here. So I'm going to enter that piece. And you can see that's come up on the timeline at the bottom. If I scroll the timer forwards to it further on, and I'm just going to add a general comment um, at the end saying, please say thanks for watching. So I've added those. I'm going to say require changes. So Alejandra's now done her reviews. So if we go across to Fiona, Fiona's also got requests. So let's go into the requests here. And here she's got a proof for mansions. What we can also see already is that Alejandra has put in the comments here. And so Fiona has got one response pending. Actually, I agree with Alejandra Rojas. And so I'm also going to say require changes. That's done. Go back to the sheet. Once you to view three Madrid mansions, here's the proof. And what we can see is, please let me have feedback on the title. And what I can do is see all the other content here. And so I can reply to this one here and say, um, good for me. And then what I want to go down to see any other documents here. And let's just put a comment here for visibility and say, consider joining the lines. Okay. And equally, I'm going to say approve in this case, and I'm going to post that comment. So now both are done. If I go back to the master here, and so this is the demo productive account where I've submitted. You'll see the notifications have come in in terms of Alejandra's done the reviews and so has Fiona. So let's go back into number one first and see what's happened in this one. So Alejandra has said, please replace the sofa and please remove chair. And both have said require changes. So in this case, what I'm going to do is that's version one. To make the changes, I'm going to create a new version and I'm going to cancel the review request. I'm going to find a floor plan. I'm going to make the corrections, which I've now got the updated version. So with that updated version, I'm going to send it through here. I've got the changes. And I'm going to invite them both again and say, so Fiona, Roncal, and Alejandra Rojas. I'm going to say, um, okay, one Madrid mansions, floor plan corrected. You send that version across to them. So they'll both have that. So come out of this one. If we go into number two Madrid mansions and have a look what's happened here in terms of the feedback. So here you can see, please check formatting here. If I click on that item, it jumps straight to the point of the video where that feedback's being left and the same here as well. So again, mark that done. And I'm going to say review complete. If I click review complete, then it prevents any further comments being added to that one. So I'm going to click OK. So there's no more comments required. And if I go to number three, in the same way, number three, in this case, let's click on the proof. I can see the comments. Please let me have feedback on the title and consider joining the lines. Um, but otherwise it was approved. And so I'm going to mark out the review as complete. Okay. So final piece here is if we go to Alejandra, so the floor plan corrected. Now I'm going to review the proof. Yep. That's been done. Going to approve. So that's been sent through and let's go to 
One Madrid wrench is now corrected for Fiona. Review the proof. Again. Good to me now. Approve. So both people have approved it, Fiona and Alejandra. We go back to the master here, go to this version, go to number one, and we can click on that and see pending zero, requires changes zero, approved to fabulous, review complete. And that's going to lock it down. As you can see here, we've got the version control, and we can go back to the version control and see what was in version one and the comments, and we can see version two that this proof is now locked. So I hope that's been useful. A quick tour of proofing is an absolutely excellent capability that Smartsheet has and can save so much time and heartache on projects. Wish I'd had this on so many things I'd worked on in the past. Thank you for watching. Trust this has been useful. Please subscribe if you like these videos and want to see more like this and get in touch if you want to find out more. My name is Rich Coles from Productive Project Solutions. Thank you.